In this video, we will be discussing some of the advanced settings for the custom commands available in Streamlabs CloudBot. If you want to learn the basics about using commands, be sure to check out part one linked below. First up, cooldowns. There are two forms of cooldowns, global cooldown and user cooldown. The cooldown period for both is measured in seconds. The global cooldown means everyone in the chat has to wait a certain amount of time before they can use the specified command again. If the value is set to higher than zero seconds, it will prevent the command from being used again until the cooldown period has passed. User cooldown is on an individual basis. If one user were to use the command, it would go on a cooldown for them, but other users would be unaffected. Next, cost settings. The cost settings work in tandem with our loyalty system, a system that allows your viewers to gain points by watching your stream. They can spend these points on items that you include in your loyalty store or custom commands that you've created. Cost settings allow you to customize the number of points a viewer has to spend to use a command. You can adjust the number of points it costs to use a command based on a viewer's role in chat. The moderator cost will only affect moderators, the subscriber cost only subscribers, and the regular cost everyone else. What is an alias? Aliases are an alternative way to execute a command. With aliases, you can simply add exclamation point following as an alias so that whenever someone uses following or following target, it would execute the command as well. Keywords. The third method for executing a command is using a keyword, which eliminates the need for an exclamation point at the beginning of the command. With this method, you can have CloudBot execute the command anytime the specified keyword is mentioned. If you want the bot to respond with a link to your Discord server, for example, you could set the command to exclamation point Discord and add a keyword for Discord. Whenever this is mentioned, your bot will immediately reply and give out the relevant information. Note that when it comes to YouTube, you are required to be live for at least 10 minutes before our bot starts responding in your chat. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.